we study the third isomorphism theorem for groups, which we can summarize as that we can simplify fractions. So let's suppose that we have n a subgroup of k, a subgroup of a group g. And let's suppose that n and k are normal subgroups. Then we have the simplification g over n divided by k over n is isomorphic to g over k. So we can simplify n. So how do we prove this theorem? Well, first of all, let's see how it maps. So an element of the group g over n will be g n, and then of the coset it will be k over n. So this one maps to g k. This is our bijective map. The third isomorphism theorem is a consequence of the first isomorphism theorem, in particular of studying the following map. We map from g over n into g over k. Remember that n is a subgroup of k. So let's study this map is uh, first of all well defined because n is a subgroup of k. It is trivially a homomorphism. And it is clearly surjective. Since it is surjective and a homomorphism, what we want to study is its kernel. So what is its kernel? Its kernel is clearly all elements of k, but uh, all elements of n are trivial, so therefore its kernel is k over n. As a consequence, because this is a kernel, this is a normal subgroup, and we can divide by it. And moreover, the first isomorphism theorem implies now that g over n divided by the kernel of the homomorphism, which is k over n, is isomorphic to the image. And because this map is surjective, this is g over k. So this proves the third isomorphism theorem.